Costa, I just put some video of me in Costa and they told me to get out. So I, I've come back to Claire's before I go for my meeting with Macmillan and everyone keeps saying to me today, oh Dan, can you do a day in a life? I've done lots of days in the life of Dan, uh, but today I am doing a day in the life kind of thing and what I'm getting up to, Claire's unfortunately been to a funeral this morning so she, we're just going to go to see Macmillan and <laughs> probably put a downer on the day again, but um you know, these things have to happen. Uh, but I can't believe I got kicked out of Costa. Shame on you, Costa. Shame on you. But I'm still feeling good, can you tell? Ooh, blah, blah, blah. And I I'm still having fun with life. I was gonna do a really awesome video today, but some things have taken a bit of a twist and a turn. I'm still working, so I've had to do work this morning. Uh, and sort stuff out for people, which is hopefully now sorted. Uh, it's a massive weight off my mind um, knowing that that stuff's going to be sorted. So that's good. Uh, and now we need to just focus on getting me well um, and sorted. But someone phoned me this morning and then messaged me afterwards and said, can we do a musical production of Dan the Musical and me film it. So I am so on that. We are, we are going to do that. I think, I think that is actually going to happen. Uh, and we'll have a full Dan the Musical to put on uh, my vlog. So that's going to be awesome. <sighs> so I'm in the car, right? And we're about to go and see, oh, it's focusing the wrong thing. But I'm about to go and see the cancer people at the White House. They are people who support people. So we're just going to go and see them. Go on, wave. Yeah, there you go. There's Claire. Thank you, Claire. Okay, you've waved. Are you happy now? Are you nodding? Yeah, she's happy. There we go. Claire has appeared in a video. You can all leave me alone now. <laughs> So I'm about to see this lovely lady from uh, this it's on Vice that's set up by, uh, what's it set up by? Macmillan. Uh, they're a great organisation. I've had some arguments with them recently uh, over them manipulating certain information, but we won't go into that. That's been resolved now. So yeah, uh, they're helping me out a lot now, um, which is great. And so the hospital that I'm being treated by, um, so it's all good, all good things, as they say, like Olaf would say, all good things, all good things. So yeah, I'm still positive, I'm still in a good mood, I'm still furious uh, with everything that's going on, but I am positive. And that is the key to everything, being positive and upbeat about everything. So yeah, don't accept defeat. Even if you are feeling defeated, don't accept defeat that the White House uh, do stuff as well for like supporting families and they support uh, people going through cancer and they sort everything out for them. So it's amazing, uh, lovely people. And there's a lovely lady here who's bringing me a coffee as well. Can I ask for more? I love coffee, absolutely love coffee. So I've seen the lovely lady from the Millen service and the CAB and they've sorted out my flipping money. It's amazing, they've actually sorted something out to help me. It's awesome, so yeah. Great. Oh, and they are going to do a biopsy again, so my surgery has been put back because there might be too much cancer to do anything about from what I believe. So that'll be interesting. Let's hope for some good news. 
So for the first time in ages, someone has said to me that I have a terminal diagnosis. Uh, I hate it when they say it and they come out with it, but this lady from the Milan service, she was trying to just be helpful. They are trying to get me um, what I'm kind of owed for paying taxes and I can get PIP and stuff in this country. And I'm glad to say they've sorted it out. Um, but I am terminal. But like where I am, I'm trying to use a metaphor here. My life's not in ruins. Not at all. Failure is not an option. Failure is definitely not an option. Now let me explain something right now that being fearless in this is the only way forward. Fearless. And tomorrow's video will be about being fearless. So watch this space and see you tomorrow.